Thank you, Mr. Speaker. My question is to the Minister of Northern Development and Mines. Uh, in the three years' worth of public polling your government tabled quietly in February, one poll by the Ministry of Finance found that 65 per cent of Northern Ontarians were very concerned and 29 per cent were concerned about their local economies. In total, 94 per cent of Northerners are concerned or very concerned about their local economies. Speaker, does the minister agree that developing the Ring of Fire will boost the Northern economy and alleviate some of these concerns. Well, speaker, thank you um, to the member for the question. Maybe I'll, I'll deal with the Ring of Fire piece in the supplementary, and, but, but maybe start by just talking about the difference in the level of support that has come from this government to the municipal sector, as opposed to the level of support that did not come from the opposition Conservatives when they were government from 95 to 2003. Speaker, it is very clear and it is very obvious to the municipal sector right across the province of Ontario, not just in northern Ontario, but that the financial assistance that has flowed through a variety of programs from this government starting in 2003 has better positioned businesses right across northern Ontario and has better positioned local resident taxpayers when it comes to the communities that they live in. No thanks to the work that went on with eight years of no support from a Conservative government, no but tremendous support through a variety of programs from this Liberal government since 2003. Yes, Speaker, those programs are in place, those programs continue, and local Taxpayers are better Thank positioned you. as a result. Supplement. Mr. Speaker, I, I guess the minister didn't hear my question. 94% of Northerners are concerned about their local economies. That's very disturbing. Northern Ontarians need this government to do something to give them some hope. Mining, especially the Ring of Fire, offers that hope. This government has made lots of promises but delivered very little on this file. This government has more than once announced funding for transportation infrastructure in the Ring of Fire region. So my question, Mr. Speaker, would the minister please tell us how many dollars have been spent on transportation infrastructure in the Ring of Fire region and when can we expect to see the physical evidence of some actual work being done. Yeah, that'd be Thank good. You. Minister? Well, speaker, when it comes to support for, for northern communities, you just heard the minister. Stop. You are doing so well. When it comes to support for northern communities and businesses based in northern Ontario, you just heard the Minister of Natural Resources and Forestry run down quite a significant laundry list of supports that we've put in place to help 230 communities in northern Ontario that rely on the forest industry, like bringing back up for our forestry roads programs that were downloaded by both the previous opposition parties, the NDP when they were in government and the Conservatives when they were in government. Speaker, specifically on the mining sector, the member knows they want to focus on one problem project, that's fine. They want to try and score a few political points. You want to talk about mining, then perhaps the member opposite can ask and speak to why New Gold has just operated a mine four hours west of Thunder Bay, 600 people on a construction site, 450 people Answer. who remain employed in that operation once it's open. Mining is continuing to move forward. They want to focus on the one project. It's doing very well. Exploration's up. How's it going to be in the budget? 